Saint Paisius also predicted Brexit 20 years ago. Article by Mary Harris, I'll leave a link below for you. This was an uh, article written just after the Brexit vote. Elder Paisius, who is a recent saint of the Greek Orthodox, the Christian Orthodox Church, a Greek saint that is the Nostradamus of Greece. Of course, Nostradamus was not a Christian saint, whereas the prophecy, the gift of prophecy is real in his saints, in God's saints. Now, St. Paisius was canonized uh, last year, a well-known monk, that is two years ago, a well-known monk of Mount Athos. He was considered a sage ascetic and was sought after for advice by many believers while he was still among us. 20 years ago, he prophesied that the destruction of the European Union would start in the UK. He said it won't last for many years. It would be destroyed by the Brits and the Americans because they are the one nation that work together. They say, what's going on here? Is Hitler rearing his head again? And that's how they'll dissolve it. Uh, end quote. Of course, here he means that the strength of Germany is rearing so much ahead that they are saying, what's going on here? Why are they deciding to dictate to everybody who, how to run their laws and also to lose their nationality and sovereignty? That's not to be done. So his prophecies are dragging from the woodwork every time world events occur. Last year, another of his prophecies concerning the war between Russia and Turkey was revived revived following Turkey's downing of a fighter jet, a Russian fighter jet. St. Paisius said that Constantinople would become Greek again, that Constantinople being Istanbul, that it would become Greek again, that, Amer the, that Armenians would also get their property returned to them. When St. Paisius reposed in his passing July 2nd, 1994, his only will was to have lived for a few more years to see his country expanded. Quote, Turkey will be dissected, he wrote. This will be to our benefit as a nation. This way our villages will be liberated, our enslaved homelands. Constantinople will be liberated, will become Greek again, end quote. He prophesied that tough times would come. He did, he did foresee the Greek... Uh, um, bankruptcy and the economic crisis, uh, at least two decades before it came upon us, but that God would help bring the interests of greater powers in alignment with Greek interests, so not because of justice or friendship, but because it would be to their benefit, end quote. St. Paisius was born Arsenius Esnepidis in Pharasa, Cappadocia of Turkey, Asia Minor in 1924. His family moved to uh, northern Greece, Bonitsa and Epiros, following the population exchange, and he grew up to be a carpenter. He also served as a radio operator in the Greek Civil War, at, uh, that was after the um, uh, Second World War. As a monk, he became famous for his spiritual teachings. In his youth, he was at uh, Mount Sinai, the monastery, uh, the male monastery of St. Catherine, and then he moved to the holy mountain, Mount Athos. And he has uh, been known to have a lot of prophecy and many, many healings, cures, and you can uh, see a lot of videos on his life on YouTube if you'd like to learn more about him, his tremendous graces.